Hello anyone and everyone, I am Echo, and today we're exploring Fallout 3 once again. In the last episode, we uh, cleared out the uh, National Guard Depot and uh, made it to the little vault down below where we got some cool weapons and stuff and a, uh, also a bobblehead that unfortunately we can't actually use because we made our character too good. Oh, hey, whoops, there's a people over there. Yes, I meant to say people. We'll just pretend I did. Um, but yeah, also, um, there was that locked vault door that, uh, yes, of course, because I'm a dirty, rotten, cheater, horrible person, I looked up how to get through there because I had no idea. Turns out it's not something we can do right now, and... We might not do it ever. I don't know. Depends. We'll see how things go. But basically, you need to collect, like, four or five pieces of this different... Uh, of this, uh... Thing. Crap. I forgot what it's called. What are they called? These things. The, uh... Um... Audio thingies. Audio recordings. Whatever. Yeah, you need to find four or five of those, and they are spread out over the entire game world. And each piece of them comes with a different uh, part of a code that the game, you know, sort of just automatically remembers that you have, and then it'll open up that door when you examine the computer. Now, what is going on over there? Um... Well, there's clearly some Enclave dudes over there. Not sure what the fire is for. But... Oh, uh, I think we can avoid them for now. They're not in the way. Not too badly, at least. Um, right now, since I forgot to mention, we're on our way to Tacoma Park and Tacoma Industrial. Which, I'm hoping, are outside of the DC city walls. And, uh... Cannot proceed in that direction, please turn back. Oh boy. This is, uh, this is where we were just a second ago. Oh no. Oh my god. They're not outside the city walls, they're inside them. They're very, very, uh, thoroughly inside the city walls. Damn it. But again, more invisible walls. What's the purpose of these? You've got these tall... God, I, I know I'm probably... I've probably ranted about this enough. But they've got these tall... Blocks... Of, uh... You know, stuff... Shitty rubble and crap that we can't walk past. Why do you need to do... An, an invisible wall on top of it? Why? It's maddening absolutely maddening. Ugh. But anyway, um, well, I'm not gonna waste the time walking all the way back. Uh, Vernon Square North will probably get us closest to there. And actually, I can, uh, yeah, I can set a marker on that. And then we can just follow the marker to get over there. That should make things a little bit easier for finding it, because I don't want to spend too much time trudging around anywhere in DC at all. I thought we were done with it. I spoke too soon. Damn. Which way am I supposed to go, game? You're pointing me in two directions. Oh, wait, that one's for the main quest. Never mind. Never mind. Let me look at the local map real quick, too. Oh, wait. The marker's telling me to go back out. The, uh, the personal marker that I set. We're in East Sash Tacoma Park. Okay. So I need to go over there. And go into that metro tunnel. I accidentally fast traveled to the wrong one, I guess. Oh, darn. Oh, don't tell me. Great. Great freaking invisible wall, but let me guess, the map is stupid again. Is that, uh, Vernon East slash Tacoma Park, is that right here, Vernon Square East? You know what? Can't fast travel when enemies are nearby. 
Because there's that jerk off. Just great. Fantastic. Lovely. Let me just try to get far enough away that the game doesn't consider him nearby. Now we go here. Okay. Now, uh... Did I mess it up? Nope, not really. <laughs> I think... Is this the correct thing? I can't even tell. We'll see when we get in there, I guess. Oh well. But, uh... Anyway, yeah, about the code thing... Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the correct way. Yep, it is. Awesome. Woohoo. Yay me. Um... Turn on light. And get out a gun, because we haven't been here before. Or, or, or we have, I guess. We have? I thought the... I guess... Oh, is this the place that we just poked our head into that one time? Or a couple times? I'm not sure. Huh. Actually, one sec. Okay, sorry about that. Anyway. Um, but yeah, about that code. That was something I was thinking about. Uh, that just sort of confuses me. Or whatever way you want to put it. Where, how come... How, wait, how do we even get over there? Isn't this a... Oh god, the map won't scroll for some stupid reason. Um, that's weird. I guess directly behind us would be... Sort of looks, according to the map, like there should be a way over here. But this is just wall. Okay, well, let's look all around, I guess. Um, but anyway, about that code. Because how come we can hack some computer terminals, but not others. Like, the entire point of hacking a computer terminal, when you do that stupid little mini-game where you break in, yeah, we've already been down here, and this is a dead end, quite thoroughly. Oh, that's the safe that we broke. We weren't even here that long ago. Damn. Um, and it's, yeah, it's up that way. How in the world do we get up there? Uh, anyway, the, uh, thing, god damn it, I'm losing my track, losing my, losing my, my thoughts, my brain's going bad, because uh, the entire point of hacking the terminals is that we don't know the password to get into the terminals, and so when we hack them, we do the little mini game to figure out the password. So how come some terminals like that one in the National Guard Armory, can't be hacked. We instead need to find the password for them. Oh! Oh, right, you guys. I completely forgot you were down here. My alert kings. Awesome. There you go. And he's not even dead. Alright, I want to kill him with the last burst of uh, this so I can use the Grim Reaper Sprint to get all my AP back. There you go. Um, uh, you know, like, it just, it doesn't make sense. It's sort of like they just arbitrarily decided this area is special and just so beautiful and perfect. It's the best area. We choose favorites between our kids, blah, 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 whatever. Um, and it can't be hacked because of that, you know? And, like, I mean, I guess I understand for... <coughs> Excuse me. I guess I understand for gameplay purposes why they do that. But, realistically, it just doesn't make any sense. And, I don't know, it bugs me. It bugs me quite thoroughly. Because there's literally no difference. The hacking minigame is for the purpose of figuring out a password. So how come sometimes there's a you know, computer that we don't know the password to that we just can't even attempt to hack. I don't know. I don't know. It's just weird. But whatever. Anyway. Continuing on through Mirelurk land here. Why are there even Mirelurks down here? Like, okay. That almost answers my question. There's some water here. Some severely irradiated water. 
and uh, you are in the way. There's a lot of Meyer Lurk Kings down here in particular. Not even just regular Meyer Lurks. That's really weird. It's incredibly weird, in fact. But yeah, I mean, wherever there's Meyer Lurks, there's always water. But, so I guess, I guess there must be, like, a lake or a river leaking into the subway down here. That'd be my guess. But then, why are, uh, why are, why is it only Meyer Lurk Kings and not, and not regular Meyer Lurks? And why are they so far down in the tunnel? And where did his body just go? What the heck, seriously? Where did his body go? I shot him. And it just seems to have disappeared. Amazing. Simply amazing. Oh well. Alright. Continuing on. I think we are going the right way. Yeah, we we are. Okay, it just required a little uh, finagling to get around the correct way towards our destination. Our final destination. Mwahahaha. Ha 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 ha. Yeah. I don't know. Random stupid movie reference. Not even really a reference, actually. I just said the title of a movie, but whatever. Not even a movie I like. I don't like scary movies. Like, at all. Like, I... I mean, I haven't given it a ton of thought. It's not like the most, uh pressing matter on my mind or anything like that, but I don't think I've ever seen a single... Alright, this calls for grenades. I don't think I've ever seen a single scary movie that I actually liked. Maybe that's my fault, but I don't know. Anyway, Meyer Lurks, Meyer Lurks. Get your butts blown up by a grenade. Did that kill them both? It did! Wow! I mean, I know it was a sneak crit, but normally Meyer Lurks have a absolute, like, megaton of defense if you don't hit them in the face. So I'm a little surprised. That's all. And as for you two... What's the chance? 79%? Good enough for me. There you go. Take that, and you'll need another one. There you go, you can have it. And that killed both of them again. Awesome. Yeah. Perfect. I love efficient use of grenades. And, uh, that's... Ooh, that's not worth it at all. Yeah. Not at all. I wouldn't have even considered looking in those if I remembered how bad the uh, Meyer Lurk egg meat is. But I didn't, so that's why I looked. Yep. 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 That's a uh, brilliant commentary. Lovely. Wonderful. 100%. Great. Maximum impact professional video game commentary from yours truly. Can I get in here? Please. No, nothing in there anyway. Fine. And one more nuke cola machine before we go. Grab all those. Take out my gun again. And let's see what's out in Tacoma Park. Another place that I don't believe I've ever been. I don't think I have, at least. I don't know. Maybe. I can't remember. I honestly can't remember anything, but uh, this area definitely does seem disturbingly blocked off from the rest of DC for some stupid reason. We buy and sell 99 cent 53. Oh, 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 God. Uh. 
Why is everything blowing up? I saw that rocket fly by from the super mutants. But jeez. Alright, let's quick save in case I screw this up. You guys interrupted my sign reading. How rude. Jeez. Um. Hmm. Plasma grenades? I don't have a fat man or any... Yeah, I don't have anything better. So, sure. There you go. Super mutant overlord. Taking plasma to the face. So what they do best. There you go. He's gonna take all four of these. Well, at least the other two got killed. That's good. That's actually doing decent damage to him. I, I am happy for this. Alright. Let's do one more. And then uh, finish him off with frag grenades, I guess. We don't have much else to be using for these. Oh! Don't blow me up! Dude! Jeez! Don't blow me up, dude! Er, bro? That's the... That's the meme. That's the meme I meant to say. Don't... Oh, oh, oh stop ex Stop, stop! Stupid... That was the bus, wasn't it? It was. Jeez. Everything in this section of town is out to kill me. USO Club, that's probably another one of those stupid places. Ugh. All those places from the that mod. Which I probably would be going in and exploring if I had the time, but I just don't. Anyway, we buy and sell 99 cent nifty thrifties fast cash stereo TV gun pots and pans computers, tools, cars, new and used. There you go. Is that a, uh, is this an actual place? Nifty Thrifty? I don't know. I don't know. Does it appear on the mini-map? I'm pretty sure... Maybe. I don't know. Nifty Thrifty. Chairman Mouse. Chop Suey. Vernon East. Tacoma Park. Uh, what about... Hold up, hold up, hold up. This place over here. The USO Club. This is... Okay, this also appears on the map. So I'm pretty sure the locations that get added by that mod, the uh, DC interiors thing, pretty sure those locations get marked on the mini-map. I mean, I could be wrong. Maybe uh, USO Club is uh, an original location from the game, but I kind of doubt it. It doesn't sound like an original location. And why is there just a crap ton of food over here going unused? Oh, pork and beans. Okay. And sugar bombs. Yeah, these... <laughs> the sugar bombs blended into the stupid papers on the ground. Very... They, they confused me. Confused me verily. That's definitely... Cornucopia Fresh Grocers... Yep, that also appears on the map. I know there's this one in particular, the Cornucopia Fresh Grocers. Those are definitely locations added by the uh, by the mod, so they do appear on the mini map. Great. But yeah, it seems weird that with just a bunch of super mutants around and no people, as far as we can tell, it seems odd that there would be just a big pile of food sitting in the middle of the of the sidewalk. I almost said road, but it was the sidewalk, really. Anyway, let's see what's in here. No, it's a dead person. Oh, no. I'm so scared. And 308 rounds. Nice. Can always use those. Can't get enough of them 308s. And how many of you dudes are over here? Hmm. A lot? I only see three on the map. On the map, on the map, on the map, on the map. That's just a regular super mutant. Alright, you know what? We'll have a little fun with these ones. Get as far away as we reasonably can, and we'll snipe them. 
Figure we just picked up some 308 rounds. We got five. There's three of those guys. And they all disappeared. Fantastic. Oh, there he is. Can we get him through that? Nope. Awesome. Invisible wall because of the fence. Well, I mean, it's not really invisible since it's the fence, but you know what I mean. Did that get him? I don't know. Well, crap. We already wasted three rounds and only one of them's dead. Oh. Oh, that didn't even kill him in one shot? How? It's a sneak crit and I hit him in the head. And are these just doing no damage? Jeez. Not fair game. Not cool. Not nice. So mean. Why you do this to me? Why? Why you do this? What about him? Is he... He's at full health. So I didn't even hit him with that other shot. Great. Well, this better kill him. Oh, some shots missed. Never mind. It's not gonna. Oh! Uh, Aww. Jerk. He had to go and see me. Just because it's broad daylight. <sighs> Unbelievable. This is the worst. Playthrough over. I can't believe... This is just going so badly. For him to see me in broad daylight. My character can't possibly be this... Uh... Bad or something. I don't know. I can't continue the... I can't continue the joke because I can't think of anything... Funny to put in place of the second part of that sentence there. Hey, anyway, what was the stupid thing we were looking for anyway? We're in Tacoma Park. Look at the world map. We're going for Tacoma Industrial. Is that this right here? No, it doesn't look like it. To so the Shelter Nightclub. What about up here? Ooh, this looks interesting. Needlessly blocked off upper half of the building. Great. Ooh, there's like straight up more stuff back here. And garbage, garbage gnome. Yep, that's their new name, garbage gnomes. I accidentally said garbage instead of garden. It's now official. This is canon. They're garbage gnomes. And uh, let's uh, we got some health missing. Let's eat up some Meyer Lurk meat. There you go. Yummy, yummy. For my tummy. That Meyer Lurk meat, so good. It's basically sushi, if you think about it. Oh, hey, guys. Oh, that's like... This is like a whole big area. I mean, not... Not like... An actual open area with multiple locations. Not that. I mean, it's like... It's just a big location, okay? It's big. Look at it. It's a whole big building with a... Full outside and some talent company fighting some super mutants. And yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna sit back. Let them, let them figure things out. Talent Company can probably actually win here. It's, uh, oh, now it's three against one. Yeah, Talent Company's gonna win. Fantastic, great. Can we hop up, can we do this uh, solid snake style? Huh. There you go, we did it. We never take the easy way in. Always go around, hop the fence, or whatever. That's how we do things, and the frame rate is uh, dying, apparently. That's great. Well, we discovered Tacoma Industrial. And it's broad daylight, so they're probably going to see me again. So, let's, uh, let's go over here a little bit. Just a little bit, and pop our head out. Wait for them to turn their backs. Oh, caution. He saw me. Screw you, guy. Hello. Who's there? Oh, is he gonna... 
I he is. Oh, oh, turn your back. That's right. That's a good lackey. Shit. What? Did the other one... Did Ow. both of them come over to look or something? Screw that. You You're a jerk, talent company. Oh, I want my AP back. There you go. Try to finish him off with this. Hopefully it'll finish him off. Nope, it didn't. Shit. No, you back off, shotgun guy. I'm serious. There you go. You die, and then shotgun guy can die. Oh! But we need a better gun than this, because without the sneak crits, it straight up doesn't do enough damage to uh, finish them off. So I'm thinking Paulson's revolver. <gasps> Ah! Um. Wait, why? Are, oh, they're almost dead. Cool, so I can just, like, probably do one shot to the head for each. Great. Fantastic. Oh, no, he needs two. Never mind. Awesome. Pulson's revolver. Finally doing something useful. And, ooh, pulse mines. Why do these guys have pulse mines? Um, well, I mean, I actually, never mind, that's a dumb question. Of course, they'd have pulse mines if they feel like having pulse mines. They're mercenaries, they need to be prepared for a wide variety of situations, yada, 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 and all that. And let's, uh, chug down some more Myler meat. And how about we repair old Painless with one of them hunting rifles? Looks good to me. And uh, now we're at Tacoma Industrial. Yay. And there's a bunch of dead super mutants and a whole bunch of nuclear waste in that there water. And we've got a big factory building to explore by the looks of it. But unfortunately, we're out of time for this episode. So I'll see you all next time. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye-bye.